Hey, so I just wanted to to tell people stuff. So basically, I have been getting a lot of hate on Tumblr because I posted some things about how I was struggling with my eating still and how various things in my life, like I weighed myself, I was called, I was told by my mother that I had a fat face, which isn't something you really want to hear when you're in recovery. So yeah, and I posted this thinking, this is my blog, I can put stuff out here without being judged. But evidently I was incredibly wrong. I'm so feminine. But yeah, suddenly I got this insane amount of anonymous hate telling me that I didn't know what it was like to have an eating disorder and that I could actually do with being anorexic to lose some weight. <laughs> you know what? Idiot little anon person. I've been on an EDU. I've been tube fed. I've been down at four stone. I have been wrestled to the ground because I was trying to work out. I have been put on bed rest because I was just literally about 10 seconds away from losing my life. I've developed heart conditions because of it. I have a lot of health problems because of how low my weight was. So, to be honest, yeah, I do know what I'm talking about and I do have an ED. Just because I am now at a healthy weight, or what people call a healthy weight, I call hideous, it does not mean that my ED is any less serious. There are other forms of eating disorders other than just anorexia and bulimia. It's actually binge eating disorder and Ednos and a trillion other things. It's kind of like gender, the whole spectrum. There's everything. And binge eating disorder is actually the same as anorexia in terms of what it does to your body. It can, it can cause organs to shut down. It can cause temporary damage. It can actually kill you because of the strain that you're putting on your body. And it's just because someone isn't seriously underweight doesn't mean they're not struggling with something. So if you see someone post something about how they're struggling with their eating, don't instantly go to their ask box, click anon, and start sending them shit, because that makes you such a bad person. And what you're doing to that person is you're pushing them further and further into the black hole that is eating disorders. And to climb out of that is insanely hard, okay? So if someone's in recovery, or if someone's struggling, the last thing you do is call them fat, comment on their weight, tell them that their ED is not valid, because that just makes you, and I'm sorry I hate this word, but a massive fucking cunt.